The owners of this house in the Albanian capital say this was the room where 77 years ago, a Jewish couple and their 10-year-old son were kept hidden. They say Nisim, Sara and Aaron Aladjem arrived here from Bulgaria in 1943, as World War II raged across most of Europe and that the family stayed here for 14 months in the house of Rifat Hodja and his wife Fezia. Their son, Recep Hodja, wasn't born at that time, but is proud of what his parents did. When Nazi German forces occupied Albania in 1943, they asked local authorities to hand over the names of Jews. They refused. Albania was the only German-occupied country where the Jewish population increased during the war, from a few hundred to 2,000. In order to save Jews, many in this Muslim-majority country had to improvise. There was a moment where we could not have an identity in the world. So, when we were in the Hebrew, we would have to say that we were in the Hebrew. And for all the Hebrew that we were in the Hebrew, we would have to say that there was no problem Fatos Chochia has turned his house into a museum to remember those who were saved. He says his father was among those who helped during the war and secretly sheltered Avran Ashraf, a man who had escaped from Greece. According to Israeli documents, almost all Jews living within Albania's borders during the German occupation survived, except for one family. Albanians say the reason was Bessa, a code of honour practised for centuries. It's a tradition by which you must protect anyone who knocks on your door and give them shelter, food and a bed to sleep in. The life-saving efforts of Albanian families were not discussed during almost five decades of communist rule. Only after Albania became a democratic country in the early 1990s did families start to share their stories. Recep Hodja says he has kept in contact with the Aladjem family. He says that in 2009 he visited Aaron Aladjem, who as a 10-year-old took refuge in his parents' home. Hodja, this clock, a gift from the Aladjem family, is a daily reminder of the people who were saved in this house. Oh.